Eriku bus stop was deserted, no buses, no passengers waiting for buses. At the main market bus stop, only one PMV arrived. Those desperate to get home climbed through the windows. All over Lay City were scenes like this. Adults and school children all making their way home on foot. Near the Bumayong PTC area, the PMV that was burned at about 10 a.m. yesterday. Eyewitnesses said the driver and the passenger were nearly slashed by knife-wielding youths who attacked the bus as it was dropping off passengers. This woman, who didn't want to be identified, saw what happened. Now the driver was going to come down. Schools in this part of the city have also been suspended. The education office has instructed schools to suspend classes until the tension eases. Now community is stable, stand still. Therefore, education office it think or say it's still tense. Therefore, after fourth period, or Martin you must go back to home or safely. It's understood the bus was burned in retaliation for the death of a man who was reportedly thrown out of a running PMV along this stretch of the PTC road. Circumstances surrounding his death remain unclear at this stage. On Thursday, another bus was burned by angry relatives of a woman who was killed by another PMV. They picked on the vehicle in retaliation, they stoned it and then burned it. Provincial authorities are negotiating with bus owners for services to be restored, but it's not clear if services will resume tomorrow. Scott Wyde, National MTV News, Lee.